Welcome to the tech sector. Today I'm actually building this insane desk mining PC. So I teased you guys with this last time, but for real, I'm actually building it this time. These 1070 Ti's down here is not going into this build, but these two big boxes right here has a few power supplies and a few other things that we might need to complete this build. So let's roll the time lapse and get straight to this build. Alright, so when I'm building a system, I never take breaks to talk to the camera like this, but I decided, you know what, let's try something a little new. I am not even halfway through this build, but I'm already running into a few problems, so I'm not sure if you guys wanted me to build it on the top of the desk, but I've decided I'm going to build it inside the desk. It's going to look a lot cooler that way. So I'm just going to put a piece of wood underneath here, and all the GPUs will sit on it, drill a hole in the middle of it, and the motherboard will go directly below that hole. So all of the cables just pass through quickly and easily. I'm going to cannibalize the stand that my editing station is on right now, just drill a hole in that, and the GPU's going to be, sorry, the motherboard's going to be sitting inside of that. Power supplies, that's the next issue. Haven't given any thoughts yet. So once I have to cross that bridge, I will then figure that out. Alright guys, so it's April 12th, 2018, it's 2 a.m. and this system has been done for days now. I just haven't had any time to film or edit anything about it, so I'm trying to get all that done right now. So the only thing that has changed since I started was the fact that I started off with a lot of GPUs. I started off with like 13, now I only have like 10. I had to sell a few to some of my friends, they wanted them. Long story short. I replaced it with some 1070 Ti's I had recently purchased. So the system is temporary. I built this just to see is it possible to build a system in a desk and have decent temperatures. And for the fact that I don't have any active cooling going on, meaning other fans than just the GPU fans, and it's staying quite like at okay temperatures. I mean, we're in the high 60s, low 70s. I'm really happy with that. Strap some fans on here and it would be okay. That being said, this is a nightmare to set up. Absolute nightmare. And for the fact that it's unusable, I mean, like, if I were to try to sit here and actually use it, it I can't. There's heat pouring off of this thing like crazy. It's just, it's just kind of unusable. Not to mention I have a whole tower here with power supplies and a motherboard and everything. So... What I would recommend is cutting down the amount of GPUs, still build a desk mining PC. It's still possible, just fewer GPUs. Like four 1080 Ti's would be a much better use of this space rather than like, what do I have? Like five 1060's and some 1070's and some RX card and some AMD cards. Just four 1080 Ti's, motherboard, power supply, everything in this area up top. 
and you're good to go. So this has 10 GPUs in it right now. I've got an RX 580, an RX 570, 1070 Ti's, a 1066 gig mini, 1066 gig mini, 1080 mini, and a 1066 gig mini. And then I've got a 1063 gig and another 1063 gig. I almost forgot, I have two Corsair 1000 watt power supplies. I've got one in the front here, one in the back, and down somewhere in there, I don't know if you can see it or not, there's an H110 Pro BTC motherboard. That's one of the motherboards with the 13 PCI slots on it. So if we take a quick look at the temperatures, you can see most of them are high 60s, just around that 70 degree mark. The single GPU that's the hottest is 78 degrees Celsius and the only reason why it's hot is because it's this 1080 mini. The 1080s really do need a dual fan setup, kind of like the way the 1070 Ti's have over there. And that will really, really help its cooling. So if you're gonna use a setup like this, I do not recommend any mini cards, any single fan cards, I do not recommend it at all. The dual fans are the way to go. Now, I'm sure a lot of you are asking, why would someone even build this? So, two main reasons. Number one, it looks cool as hell. I mean, you've literally got what looks like a showcase at Micro Center. And number two, you may be limited on space. I know people that can't build an entire mining rack like this. So maybe a desk mining PC or a wall mining PC might be a more viable option. Now I, like I said, I built this as a test so there was no wire management done on it and if you really did want to build something like this, it would take a lot of time, a lot of effort to properly build it, wire manage it and make sure that nothing catches on fire because the temperature in there right now is quite high. So I've got my, th my laser thermometer here and as you can see, the surface of the compressed wood is at 104 degrees Fahrenheit. 104 degrees now press wood does not catch catch a fire until like 500 degrees or something like that but still this much heat in this small of a space on wood and and everything looks janky as hell don't really recommend this setup but if you guys are willing to do something like this then it is a viable option the temperatures are not that bad and keep in mind there are no active fans remember no active fans at all. On your normal mining PC, sorry, mining rig, you'd have a bunch of fans bolted onto the front like I have here, and that helps cool the cards. So if you get the same amount of fans, you put them on one side or on the front and have them blow out the back, it could actually cool them pretty well. Now that I've seen the temperatures, I'm actually going to legitimately build this rig. like build everything onto the same piece of wood. I almost forgot to go over how much nice hash is saying we're making a day. Saying about $7.09 a day, which isn't too bad at all. I showed you my general hash rates. We're doing just around 2,700 on Equihash and 32 mega hash on Dagger Hashi Moto. The only GPU that is struggling right now is the 1080 mini. As you can see, it's doing just around 380 hash. Now that's really, really bad for a 1080. Normally 1080s are supposed to be upwards of 500, but this thing is thermal throttling like crazy. You would not believe it. So that's why it's down below 400. Other than that, this has been a success actually. You know, the temperatures are bad, but they could be better. And I'm really happy with the outcome of this project. So I will be doing the official build soon. I can't wait to also do my desk PC over here. And the most important thing is that I'm going to be coming out with another mining profitability video of my entire mining farm. So that's going to include all of my systems. So it's going to include the desk mining PC, my workstation over there, my window mining PC, which some of you may, might be familiar with, and also the entire mining rack. So definitely stay tuned, subscribe, like, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Enjoy. Have a good day.